here's the place. Green Apple Books and Music. Now, my girlfriend said that there was a, like, a family section that had, like, Disney DVDs and DVDs in here. Um, I'm just hoping that there's, like, other DVDs here besides the family one that, uh, I saw. So, into Apple Books we go. Alright guys, this is a pretty big, big bookstore in here. Tons of stuff. Just books galore. Pretty cool. Here's like a room. And then there's upstairs. Look at this. Like toys and stuff. Whoa, this is like the children's place or people with my brain that likes children's crap. Legos, look at this. This is a pretty cool store. And the other store next door is the one that has the DVDs. But I thought I'd just come in here and kind of show off books, Spy Cat and books. Come on. Well, you know what? She was good in Rhinestone with uh, Sylvester Stallone. One of my favorite movies of all time. But it looks like there's a lot of... Look at that. Pretty cool. I mean, this bookstore goes on and on. On and on. Just kids' books go on. See, I like the toys and stuff. Oh, no way. Is there another upstairs? There's a third freaking floor? Guys, this is it. The, the bookstore, like, extravaganza or some crap. They got, like, little... Look at this. They have, like, little... I don't know what that stuff is. And that's kind of... Holy crap. Guys, this is the, the book capital. The best bookstore I've ever seen. Three floors of books. And this is just one of the two stores uh, that's connected to this store next door. The one with the DVDs. But pretty cool store. Definitely. Cool. I mean, it goes on and on. There's a room. There's another place there. <clears throat> I mean, they have everything here. It's like... Cards on this rack. And it just goes on and on. Holy crap. These puzzles or games or games. Pretty cool. This is an interesting store. You thought the last video store you could be in for days and hours at that VHS store, but you never... I mean... This store is just, it's its going on and on, guys. Apple Books on Geary and Six. Okay, I gotta find my way out of here. I'm lost now. I'm lost in the bookstore. Holy crap! Space Invaders! This is awesome. This is so random just to be singly on the shelf. 
freaking space invaders. Um, looks like it's 30 bucks, so that's kind of a... Oh. What the hell? Okay, I'm lost. We gotta find our way out of here, guys. Because now, I'm a little lost. A lot of Harry Potter stuff. We looked at that. I, I, I mean, did I even go back there? I think I went back there. This is pretty crazy. I'll read that when I watch this video, or you guys will. Kind of interesting, Dick Tracy. Pretty cool. We're going. Apple books. Oh, wow, I didn't even get this stuff, did I, on the way up? I mean, just tons of stuff everywhere. Oh, wow, they even got a mask. Uh, they have a mask set up. Holy crap. They have a mask set up going all the way down to the end. Mass on the wall. This is crazy. Pretty crazy store. Sorry about that. I mean, everything is here. I've never... This is uh, a big day. I wish I had more batteries. But tons of stuff here. I gotta get out of the store, guys. There's upstairs, there's downstairs. I think there's another, there's another. Let's go next door to the DVDs. Oh man. But it goes on and on. Over here is mass. Right there. Pretty cool. The masks are cool here. Yeah. Oh wow, it's even on this side. There's masks all over the place. Oh wow, these are like the huge ones. Look how big these ones are. But um, just tons and tons of collector crap that I like. Thinking putty. Books outside on the sides. I'm outside and there's books. Oh man, Spy Cat has did it again. Spy Cat did it, Prince. I'll be famous like you soon. But let's go over, where is it? Oh, so we have to skip like to a haircut place. This is like the uh, Richmond district, kind of an Asian, Asian district of San Francisco. I took an Uber here. Um, Here's like used books outside. Um, yeah, you do. You guys have DVDs in here? No, they, back this way. Oh, back that way? Okay, thanks. There's like a room here that's like t shirts and bags and man. It's, it's overwhelming here. Oh, wow. I'm drawn to like whales. That's in Tenderloin. Hey, that's so cool. That's cool. Oh, God, feminist. Shut the hell up for once. Jesus. They're so oppressed. I'll get some comments from that one. But, uh, wow. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, man. They got freaking gremlins. They have a gremlins one. See, I would want to get this gremlins one. Ten bucks, so. That's pretty cool. Oh, they got the uh, other guy. They got uh, Batman's. Uh, but, um, cool store you guys got. Cool store. I've never even been here. <laughs> It's crazy. I mean, look at the... Oh, go ahead, man. I'm sorry. That's cool. Bears are cool. This is cool. Wow. 
I gotta get to the back of the DVDs. It's been 10 minutes. Um, and then every book gets charged against that account. So you couldn't shop left. Because, yeah. Isn't that crazy? 867. Just little knickknacks and crap. Diner nuts. So there's like an aisle here. It's gonna go all the way back here. Here's like the magazine rack. Wonder Woman. Crazy, craziness. <sighs> oh crap, they got they got freaking records. They got Blu-rays. Holy crap. Holy crap. Crap on the bottom of my shoe. Holy crap. A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. This is this is a hoarder's paradise in San Francisco that I didn't know about. That is insane. Look at this. I was thinking like one shelf of DVDs, like because she sent me the picture of the um of like the family Disney DVDs. So I thought it was just like a little a little part in a bookstore. But this is amazing. This is the jackpot, the mother load of books, DVDs. There's another thing of DVDs. They might have as much as I do. I have about 7,000, 8,000. Um, holy crap, nice, nice, nice. Here's like... It's going on, and wherever I'm walking is um is a new place that I hasn't been on this video, so it is overwhelming. There's stuff everywhere, everywhere in this store. Holy crap! Look at that. Nightmare on uh, Nightmare Before Christmas dolls. That is cool. You know what? This co I'm starting to like this company that does that. Some of the characters are ugly, but this is. Whoops, sorry, man. Amazing store. Isn't this store the Shiznit guys? Nobody comments. San Francisco is like that. Pretty. Uh, everyone's to themselves. I was just thinking that in sitting in the Uber car, you go, you sit down, two inches away from someone. And because everyone's just full of themselves and full of shit, they don't even talk to each other anymore. Even when you're right next to people on the bus, it's, uh, I don't like that. It says that you're not, like, a, a person. It's like you're so, I don't know. I'm not like that. Spy Cat's not like that. I talk to everyone. I'm social. You can't be like that. It's, like, worse than, like, being a drug addict, but you're not a drug addict. But, um, wow, is, I'm going to have to dig in, guys, and, uh, holy crap, just an amazing, amazing store that only Spy Cat's going to show you. I'm pretty sure I'm going to be the first YouTuber to be in the store, movie hunting, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, oh, man. I have to go to you just just see if there's unsolved mysteries, but there's not. No unsolved mysteries. I thought I would have got lucky, but can't. And I can't spend that much money because I blew it all already. And there's like 10 days before payday. I have to get through. But wow, this is uh, this is amazing. Hip hop coloring book. Nice, amazing store, CDs. I wonder if they have VHS. I don't think they would have VHS, but... Now, where is that? Now I have to find this, this Disney section. Is there a horror section? There's got to be a horror section. Let's see. Oh, no, I think it's alphabetical order. Fifth Element. Oh, they have it. They have it all. Oh, man, Ripley. Holy crap. Guys, this is, uh, 
I keep having to focus because I'm walking too fast for the camera's brain. Um, okay, I did it again. I'm lost. Okay, let's get out of here. It's, it's too much. We've walked in about six block radius in this store, it seems like. Okay, that's half of the uh, third. Where the hell am I, guys? I know I'm on the third, the third row, or the third floor. But man, I, I think I got lost in this store. Where's the children's like Disney DVDs and like... Oh, that's going to be in the main store, a few doors to the left. Oh, the Disney DVDs and stuff? Yeah, it's going to be in the back of the kids section there. Oh, in the, in the store, like a couple stores down? Yeah, in the rest of Green Apple. Oh, okay, okay, thanks, man. Cool. Man, this is an amazing store. Yeah. This is like this, this all-star store of anything. Um, whoa, okay. We have to get out of this store and go in the store I was just at to see those Disney ones. Okay, we are at, like, the children's section in the store past the Chinese haircut place or the Asian haircut place and the other Asian restaurant. And now we're back here and we're looking for the Disney section of DVDs because that's a picture I was sent on my phone. I think it was this picture right here. Um, yeah, it was this. Okay. Let's see if they have any out of print Disney. They have a good section. Um, but it's still kind of common stuff. I got the Toy Story one. How much is it though? 25 bucks. They probably buy stuff here. Well, they obviously buy stuff because it's used DVDs. Duh. Um, let's see. I got um, called to work tomorrow, but I already have things I have to do and um, I need to concentrate on. Um, I don't know if I can go to work tomorrow. There's so much I have to do. I have to start going to meetings and stuff like. So it's kind of weird that they would want me to work. I have an appointment today, an appointment tomorrow. Um. craziness going on in the store. I'm going to have to call my boss because yeah, I, I don't... How about this one? But uh, yeah, I'm going to go DVD hunting now in uh, the other store. Turn this thing off. But this is the store of stores. Okay. This is like an Asian health food store. I thought I saw a haircut place. Oh yeah, this is a haircut place in there. And now we're at the bookstore. Okay, we gotta go in those DVDs now. Um, you guys don't have VHS, do you? No. no? Oh, you have some tins up there. That's cool. I have some uh, Disney tins. Um, let's see, this books, but yeah, this is the, uh, the last remaining one of them, DVD stores, it's not like Amoeba Rasputin, pretty cool, a lot of stuff we got going on in here, look at that, they got the box set of Planet of the Apes, I'm gonna look through all this guys. I'll be back. Alright, so I'm in the DVD section right now. And uh, the, the prices are a little bit pricey for having a lot of DVDs. Um, but I am finding like some Anchor Bay as well as some artisan ones that are out of print. So, uh, but it is a little bit pricey. 
Criterion. 1795 used. Look at this slip cover right there. They got some some different stuff. I've been waiting to see some different stuff and the same old crap. Um all alphabetically. They should do it section by section. Horror movies and stuff like that. It's harder to find stuff this way. But then you can look at everything this way though too on the other hand. What is this? Anchor Bay title. I never seen this one. Thirty bucks, holy crap. They're tripping. Unless it's like a hundred bucks. Let's see. Tons of stuff. A lot of devil stuff. Devil's Reign, what the crap? Devil's Reign. Oh man. Craziness in. Lots of stuff here. Lots of stuff. I'm looking for Anchor Bay. This is what you do. You just look at like Masters of Horror, one I've never even heard of. That is crazy. Stuff I never heard of. Anchor Bay, again. Heavens Above. Only eight bucks? Wow. Holy crap, guys. Holy crap. The Mother Load. First, it was the greatest VHS store less than a week ago. Now it's freaking the best. The other best DVD hunting stuff video. Oh man. This blows half price books out of the water. Um, they have a big selection at half price books though too. Evil Dead, uh, Army of Darkness, seeing some uh, anchor bays. Okay, there's another anchor bay. Man, I just want to buy all the Anchor Bay Hammer Collection. Okay, so, what is this? Tin? Oh, I have that. Okay. Um, more Anchor Bay. Let's find more Anchor Bay. Holy crap, this has got... This has got the greatest selection. Anchor Bay, I have that one. Um... I mean, crap, guys, look, they got the Halloween Anchor Bay one. I think I got the other one. Wow. This is amazing. I'm going to have to pick up the Anchor Bay stuff. I'll look it up, but this is, uh, this is crazy, guys. Craziness in the store. Wow. Crap. Tons of stuff. What is this? Just stuff you've never even heard of. Holy crap. Republic Pictures, that one, some of those are out of print. Um. Criterion. Give me some anchor bays and some outer printers. Yeah, man, they got everything here. Everything. Not comparable to my collection, but they uh, have it all. Anchor Bay, Schlock, it's 35 bucks. Okay, they, they obviously are up on 
What's out of print? Shit. Man, this is... It's going on and on. Wow, look at this stuff here. They got that one. Got some Texas chainsaw. They got this one, that one's out of print. <sighs> okay, that is a deal. They didn't know. They didn't know about that one, guys. See if it's not scratched. Because that one's worth some money. Um, you guys are seeing hunting for out of prints in the process. Don't worry guys, I'm not talking to myself, I'm the phone. Huh. As I said, they, uh, people have no personality. It's, it's weird. Spy Cat's not like that. But people are, and that's why it gets me so angry that people are just so not social to themselves. They think they're better than everyone. Fuck them. The unbelievable truth. I think this is out of print. Wow, they got some freaking amazing out of print stuff. Out of print, out of print hunting, out of print shopping with Spy Cat right now. My boss gave me a chance. She told me not to quit, but now they need me. But they gave me such short notice. I'm gonna have to tell them I can't work tomorrow. I, I'll think about it a little bit more. But um, that's the gossip of what's happening today in Spy Cat's life. Ah, what the fuck? I just saw trash, that looked pretty gay. Um, let's see. Let's see what's on this side. Silent. <sighs> oh, maybe Unsolved Mysteries might be. Here's some Blu-rays. Pretty cool selection over here. Let's see. TV. Oh cool, they got like some. I gotta continue hunting. All right, guys. Shit. Exactly what I thought would happen happened when I came into the store. I have like 10 days before the next payday. Not too much money. This was supposed to be for food and my cell phone bill and other crap. But I found too much crap. That pile is a must. 
I have to take that home today. It's a big pile. I looked up everything, what it's going for on eBay. Super deals, super scores. Um, I'll just show you guys what I'm not gonna get. Um, I'm gonna see how long they can hold this stuff for. Army of Darkness, I'll get it next time. Archive Collection, Fast Walking James Woods. And they have a cop, nobody has the old boys. This is out of print as well. But they have like five of these, so. On hold. Uh, Dracula, Anchor Bay. I can't get this right now. But, um, because I got a huge pile. <laughs> I'm over my limit. It's going to be one, one of those times where I'm going to have to ask other people to help me pay my bills because I'm a hoarder. Spy Cat is a hoarder and it is an addiction as well as any other addiction for me. Maybe not for you other collectors. Maybe you can do it, but when I see stuff like this, I got to grab it, have it in my collection. The covers, the old school stuff, Anchor Bays, must have them, got to have them. Great store. I'm also not going to get Evil Dead, the steel book, which I need in my collection for 13 bucks. I'll get that one next time. Um, I really wanted to get this because it's got the uh, old school slip cover. This is an amazing, amazing cover. Wow. I don't think I could wait. Okay. That's going in the pile too. Shit. How am I going to get through the week, work week, with not that much money? Uh, to eat for those days. This is a hoarder's problem, a collector's problem. This is my problem. This is the kind of shit I do. Only two days in from getting my last paycheck. Ten days to go. With not that much money. Especially if I do what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to do it. Screw it. I love these movies. They're all I got. Nah, just joking. But obviously, I love these freaking movies. Anyway, crap. Let's get out of this store. Oh man, what do you guys see? The score, Anchor Bay scores I got. Whew. Wow. My high is fulfilled. But when I blow that money and my pockets are empty? Huh. I haven't hit the come down part of this binge high, but the high's there. There's going to be a come down part. I'm going to be high, then I'm going to go down. As soon as the money has gone out of my pockets. Let's just see that money one more time. Oh man. Oh shit. A hoarder's life, a collector's life. Oh man. Crap. Why did my girlfriend have to send that text picture and show me this store? Why? I'm blaming you. Because I'll probably have to borrow money from you because I did this. Shit. And before I'm walking out the door, there's also like all these collector sets that are kind of sells for a little bit more money. They have a lot of like out of print stuff. Look at the, uh, sorry, look at the old school comic books that are like worth a lot of money. Sells for a little bit. These are so old school. The store is, uh, is the best. They even have the Beatles uh, rare record, not the one with the babies, uh, those dolls, but like this other one, Yesterday and Today, which sells for like 1500 bucks. But pretty cool stuff. Right. Look at that, they got a John Travolta uh, record right there. That John Travolta one's awesome, man. That's crazy, that was way back. Let's see. And then, like I said, they have the Disney treasures right there. As well as, like, bigger sets. But, yeah, awesome store. Awesome store. This is, um, I'm broke. Yeah, I'm broke. I don't know what's going to happen in the week with no money, but that is the store, guys. Thanks, guys. See you guys later. Oh, man. But now we are off to get a drink. I 
I can like drink like two 20 ounce anythings right now because that wait a minute oh no I that's right I was like is there a third store but no I I went to the other one the second one then I went back I went to the first one I went to the second one then I went back to the first one then I went back to the second I, I don't know what happened in there oh man I just got lost in my own brain just like I got lost in that big the big ass bookstore and DVD store oh man it is crazy 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 that store got me for a ton of money uh, the, the dislikes that I have uh, with that store is um, the fact that I had to put two DVDs back uh, b due to scratches. Now the smudges and the scratches, they, they don't really put that into consideration with the price of the movie, which kind of is stupid. I, I think they shouldn't do it that way. But um, I think if it has smudges or a scratch, you don't sell it for a high price. You should sell it for a cheaper price. But uh, we have to find somewhere to eat. I had some KFC earlier, but I just want like a drink or something right now. Um, well, it looks now like I have to go to work tomorrow because I'm broke and I need to make the money back. So I'll go to work tomorrow just because of what I did today. It looks like we're, we're going in the, the Asian store because we're in the Asian district. And um, I, I don't think they're used to seeing Spy Cat with a video camera in the Asian store. I, ju I just don't think so. Oh man, I'm lost. Oh man, is this gonna be all Asian drinks? Tell me they have some American stuff. Please, oh, ragu, okay. So they have ragu, so it's a sign that they could have some American fish? I thought that was the back, but it's a mirror. Oh crap, but there is a back, oh here, sodas. Okay, we got some American sodas. I kind of like some healthy stuff, but I don't see that much healthy stuff here. I'm not going to start trying out Chinese Asian drinks. I just, it's not me. This stuff tastes like shit, complete shit. But we are in the Asian supermarket. As much as I really want to do the voice, guys, I'm not going to, because then you guys are going to label Spike at all races when it's all just fun to me and joking around. We've all done the Asian voice. Okay, there wasn't anything good or healthy drink-wise in that store. Oh, it's sprinkling rain right now. Like the Wicked Witch, I'm going to melt. That, why'd I say that? What the hell is wrong with it? Sandwiches, desserts. I just want to get like a drink of some sort something some drink but not like a soda like something good there's got to be a good place i'm just okay i'm just going this way i'm gonna walk a couple of blocks it looks pretty uh Hiya. what's in here yeah hi yeah that guy's doing karate or something in there i don't know what they're doing Ooh, they have smoothies for 575 man they better 575 my butt Oh man, ice cream sundaes and soda floats? I just spent money. I cannot do a $6 freaking drink right now. I just can't. I want to. I want to in the Asian district. I really want to. But the money's blown. Godzilla? I never thought that Godzilla would be all over the Asian district of San Francisco. But... But, um, whoa, Flintstones. Wow, other stuff, action figures. Wow. We're gonna have to do out and about in the Asian district because there is, I mean, this is a freaking food place and, it, and it's filled with toys and collectibles. Oh man, is that Pinocchio? Look at that, they got, they got freaking uh, Harry and Hendersons, holy shit. Oh man, guys, look at this. Rock'em Sock'em Crash Dummies. Oh man, guys. I hit the mother load. I hit the mother load. Gumby the poster? Oh man, guys, this is amazing. This is, this is a uh, big out and about day for me. I'm excited. I'm happy. 
and I'm broke as shit. I should not have spent the money I did on movies and collectibles, DVDs and VHS and laser discs, like I did. Um, no, no, no 575 smoothie. No 575 smoothie. I can't right now. I can't. I can't. Oh man, I'm gonna cry. This is what. See, this is the downside. There is not $200 in my pocket like there was. And that was supposed to last me for the week and pay for a $160 cell phone bill. Shit! Why? Why does Spy Cat do this crap? Why does Spy Cat do this crap? Oh man, I don't know. I did not think that was going to happen. I didn't think that was going to happen at all. I didn't think it. Oh man, I'm broke. Oh man, I am broke. That was a dumb idea. Do I have any ones left? Did I spend the ones? No, I gave him the 200. So I, oh man, why did I do that? Why, the movies, the Anchor Bay titles out of printers. Sells for 35 bucks. Sells for 60 to 100 bucks on eBay. I could not pass up those deals. Oh man, the way I'm talking and moving my hand and doing these hand things, it's almost like I'm cinema sickness. I don't have a Spy Cat Jr. And I don't want to talk like this all the time. But, Cinema Sickness is great. Shout out to P-Mac Movies. Shout out to uh, MJ75. Woo! Nobody heard me. I'm a little embarrassed. But I don't think anyone heard me. That was kind of weird to do that on the street. But it's like whenever I say MJ75, I have to do his woo! I just have to. But anyway, we are in the Richmond District right now. Um, yeah. We're in the Richmond District. You know, there is another place with DVDs up the street. But the last of my remaining money is for food and drinks. I am gonna borrow some money for my cell phone. Definitely pay it back when I get paid. I don't wanna work tomorrow, but I guess I need to because I blew all the money. But um, we're going up the street to go, um, that's crazy, the, the, the guy said potty for the dog going to, whatever. Anyway, hold on, let me, my hand's getting a hell of tired. Okay, I can't do it that way, so I have to hold it this way. Okay, that's better. This arm's tired. Oh man, I have to go to work tomorrow, crap. <sighs> I'm gonna start saving money. I cannot be blowing money like this. Like I said, for Spy Cat, this is an addiction. This is one of my problems, but it is a healthy hobby unless you do what I just did and blow it off fucking paycheck. I was not supposed to be cussing either, but that's right. Yeah, I blew my paycheck again in two days, um, as well as other money that I had. Stupid, 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 but it's okay. It's okay. We're gonna be fine. I can go through my movies, maybe sell some movies, to get money, but I, I'm good. I have money for the week to eat at work. That's the most important thing. Um, yeah, crap. I should not have spent that money, but we are off. Up the street, a couple blocks from here is that old place that has all the classic toys and uh, other stuff like that. We're gonna go look in there for the second time and uh, see what's in there. Yeah. How much is an icy? The icy? Yeah. How much is an icy? Icy? Yeah. It's the same price as the regular, just small ones, two twenty-nine. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, fuck. Hold on. All right, guys. I got my freaking Burger King icy for like two bucks. As much as I wanted to do a nice, healthy smoothie, I decided to do something that was filled with a lot of sugar like I shouldn't be doing. But we are here at Family Salvation Army. Hold on, let's check. Right there. Oh, that way. Family Store Salvation Army. Here we go. 
it's not icy. There's no icy in this. I'm gonna bring it back because uh, it's. I mean, you can see the drip. It's not like icy. It's not even like at the correct temperature. That sucks. All right, into the Salvation Army we are and go and are in right now. All right, we're at the DVDs. DVDs are four bucks. What a bunch of crap, but they're one flat rate. That's a cool one. Whew, I drank that icy too fast. I got that like, like throat freeze, which is like a brain freeze, but it's like a throat freeze. Kind of weird crap. Okay, they're pretty, <laughs> some pretty weird stuff. Looks like somebody gave four bucks isn't really worth it. Jacob's Ladder. I guess they have like a whole Christian section, but it's upside down. Some old school cartoons from the 80s and 70s. Old 90s. Greatest Heroes Legend. I like these ones. I have them downloaded. You can watch them on YouTube. They're about like the Bible and crap. I got a blue, right? Pretty cool. I, I want to watch this one. There's another. Man, being the collector that I am, I would want to get just to have all these collections. I'm sure no one will buy those and they'll be here for another day to get. I, I just want to see if there's any out of print anything. Um. Here's a movie you don't see too much, Eye of the Needle. Fuck. But yeah, that's pretty much it. It's only like these baskets right here, guys. That's it, just those baskets right there. But um, this is where they have a lot of toys and stuff. Um, but let, let's go, let's see this store. I mean, we have, I've made some classic videos for you guys the last couple of days. Shit, I gotta go to work tomorrow. Crap. Do not want to go to work. But uh, upstairs is where all the collectible toys are. So upstairs, here we go. Are at now going up the stairs. Up the stairs, up the stairs. Okay, now immediately the smell of old lady clothes hit me in the face like a ton of bricks. Oh, they changed it. There used to be more toys here. It's a lot of sugar. Let's see. Well, you know what? I'm glad I got that video last time because... They got rid of a lot of toys that they used to have. They don't have them anymore. Yeah, you know what? Go to my other video about the uh, big toy store uh, Salvation Army video I did like a couple months ago because it was so much cooler back then. It's pretty, it's not cool anymore here. It kinda sucks. But let's get out of here. Couches. They do have a lot of old school furniture and stuff that's pretty cool i'm gonna bring back this uh slushy though because there's no slush 500 bucks for that that's pretty crazy a lot of old old wood a lot of stuff going on pretty cool look at that old school bunk bed i put these things together for a living but that is old so old school look at that i got old school bunk bed that's so cool. The slots and everything. Ah, uh, let's get out of here.